Welcome. Let's solve this question on income tax. KCC paper 2, the year is 2014, question number 19. The table below shows income tax rates for a certain year. The table of taxation is given there. Study the table of taxation carefully to identify whether the amounts are given per annum or per month and also the tax rates in percentage or in pounds. The statement below, a tax relief of 1,162 per month was allowed in a certain month of that year an employee's taxable income in the fifth band was 2,108. A. Calculate 1. The employee's total taxable income in that month. Then we have the second part. That is A part 2. The tax payable by the employee in that month. Part B. The employee's income included house allowance of 15,000 shillings per month. The employee contributed 5% of the basic salary to a cooperative society. Calculate the employees net pay for that month so that is the question now let's go to the first part and in the first part you're supposed to calculate the employees total taxable income in that month now we're given tax relief then very important information that is going to help us here the taxable income in the fifth band was 2108 now look at the fifth band the fifth band is the last band that is uh, the monthly income where the monthly income is over 38,892. So what does it mean? It means that this 2,108 is the amount above 38,892. It is the amount above that figure. So therefore getting the total taxable income for this employee, we shall take the last figure in the last band that is that 8892 and since this amount that is given the in the taxable income which is 2108 is the amount above the last figure in the fifth band that is that 8892 we shall simply add so the total income will be given by that 8892 plus 2000 108 so that is what we're going to do so a part one so total income will be that eight thousand that eight thousand eight hundred and ninety two plus the amount above twenty one thousand twenty one zero eight and therefore the taxable income will be forty one thousand that is all about that part so employees total taxable income in that month you just need to take the last amount in the fifth band, then you add 2,108. Part 2. Tax payable by the employee in that month. Tax payable by the employee in that month. So for this part, we shall go to each of the bands. From the first one, we calculate the tax, the second up to the fifth. So we start with the first one. Now the first band is the one that begins from 0 to 10, 164. The tax is 10%, so we get the tax. So we'll have um, here, so we shall do it like this. So we shall have the taxable income. And then here, we shall have the, the tax. So we shall have the tax here. So the first band, uh, the amount in the first band is uh, 10,164. And the tax rate is 10%. So when you calculate 10% of that, you will get 10,16 and 40 cents that is a tax in the first band so the second band begins from 10 165 to 19740 so to get the amount of money taxed in that band you get the difference so 19 740 this is how we do it 19740 we'll do it separately here 19740 and then you subtract be careful here subtract 10 164 not 10,165, 10,164. This will give 9,576. That is the amount taxed in the second band. So that one, we tax it at a rate of 15%. So we shall have 9,576 times 15%. And this will give 14,36 and 40 cents. So that is the second band. So we go to the third band. The third band begins from 19741 to 29316. Again, to get the amount of uh, money taxed, 
that band you take 29 316 subtract 19 740 get that on clearly still didn't make mistake by subtracting 19 741 so you're supposed to do it like this 29 316 subtract 19 740 and that one will still give you the same amount which is um that will give you 9576 same thing to give you that then tax is uh 20 percent when you work out that you're going to get 19 15 and 20 cents we go to the other band the other band is the third this is the fourth band fourth band begins from 29 317 to 38 892 so to get the amount of money tax in that band we take 38 892 subtract 29 316 38 892 subtract 29 316 and you notice that one will still give you the same thing it will give you 95 76 times this will give you so this one is going to give you when you work out this it will give 23.94 now we go to the other band that is the last band the last band we already have the amount the taxable income in the fifth band is given the question as 2108 so 2108 times 30 percent the tax rate in that band is 30 percent so working out that this is what you're going to get you're going to get a 6 30 2 and 40 cents now we have done the taxation in all the bands so this is the first band this is the second band this is the third band the fourth band and this is the fifth band now we need to get the gross tax so when you add everything here you're going to get the gross tax gross tax by adding this column for taxation from 10 16 and 40 cents all the way so we're adding everything there so we add everything that should give 73.94 and 40 cents now the question is clear is asking about question is asking about uh, the tax payable by the employee in that month so that one requires us to get the net tax not the gross tax and to get the net tax we take the gross we take the gross tax we less the relief and the relief is given here is 1162 so we shall take we shall less the relief which is uh, 1162 and this now will give the net tax this one should give 6232 and 40 cents so that is the tax payable by this employee in that month we go to part b part b of the question the employee's income included a house allowance of fifteen thousand per month the employee contributed five percent of the basic salary to a cooperative society calculate the employee's net pay for that month how do you get the net pay net pay is part b so net pay is given by taking the gross income or what we call the taxable income then we less all the deductions and in this particular question the deductions are only two there are only two deductions that is uh the net tax is the deduction and uh, five percent of the basic salary five percent of the basic salary so we have so net tax plus five percent of the basic salary now what we don't have we have the net tax what we don't have is the five percent of the basic salary now do we go do we have the basic salary no we're not given the basic salary now how do we get the basic salary basic salary is given by by taking the taxable income we take the taxable income and then we less all the taxable allowances all the allowances that are given the taxable income is also referred to as the gross income and in this case the taxable income is the one that you obtain in the first part of the question which is 41000 it was 41000 so it is a 41000 now we need to get the allowances the allowances are there they are they're given uh, the allowances are there when you go to the question we take go back to the question uh, house allowance 15000 so we less that 15000 and this one will give uh this 26 this will give 26000 26000 so now we can get the amount for cooperative shares uh 5% employees contributed to 5% of the basic to cooperative society 
so 5% of that now we have the basic salary so we take uh, so for the cooperative society we have 5% of the basic salary which is 26000 and this one should give 1300 1300 now we have the two deductions we have cooperative society then you have the net tax so the deductions will be the net tax 6232 and 40 cents 6232 40 cents plus 1300 and this one should give 7532 and 40 cents now we can proceed and get the net pay the net pay or the net salary that one will be given by the gross income which is 41000 now we're back to these here subtract all the allowances uh, not all the allowances but i think i drew the wrong arrow here so we have we are back here so we are here where you have the net pay that is uh, what you're supposed to do so net pay is given by a taxable income which is 41000 then less of the deductions we've got the deductions net tax plus tizia tizia the deductions so subtract 75 32 and 40 cents and this now gives the net pay as 33000 33467 and 60 cents so that is the net pay 33467 and 60 cents so that is how you're supposed to solve that question